All right, I hope this video finds you. You know, the, the internet is amazing to me. It's just, it's like throwing a bottle in the ocean with a letter inside and someone's gonna get it and I hope it's you. All right, so I'm chasing 585 pounds. But the interesting thing about this is that I have an Ironman coming up. If you don't know about the Ironman, the Ironman is a grueling race. It's um, a 2.4 mile swim in the beginning. The last time I did it, it took me two hours. It took me two hours to do it. It was a very long swim. And then the bike ride is a 112 mile bike ride. What are you shaking your head for? And then after the 112 mile bike ride, we have um, a marathon at the end, which is a 26.2 mile run. So I'm getting ready for that. I love powerlifting though. I don't know why he's shaking his head. I love powerlifting though. I love lifting weights. And the two sports just don't go together. So right now I'm chasing 585 pounds. Oh, we're eating blueberries. Uh, blueberries, strawberries, raspberries. Can you see that? Right there. All right. And um, I'm going to let you guys know, if you're trying to increase your strength, if you're trying to get a better time on a 10K, if you're trying to get a better time on a marathon, one thing that you have to do is you just, you just have to know that you can do it, that it's possible. Let me give you a good example. About eight years ago, I was squatting 405 pounds. If you don't know about lifting weights, or if you don't know about weights, that's four 45s on each side of the Olympic part. <clears throat> then all of a sudden, um, I see this guy, he gets five plates on each side, which is 495 pounds, 500, almost 500 pounds. Now I, look, I looked at the guy and I was a little bit bigger than him, but I knew I was better than him because I used to see him bench press, I used to see him run, I used to see him do all these other activities and I was always better than him Hold on, son. I was always better than him in all those activities except for the squat. So when I saw him squat more than me, I put two and two together and I thought, you know what? I have to be able to do that because I know I'm better than him. When you see somebody else do something, when you see a mortal person do something, you can do it too. If one man can do it, anyone can do it. All right? So whatever you're chasing, whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're trying to accomplish, you have to believe it's possible. So after I saw him squat, I squatted, I kept working on it, and I surpassed his squat by far. Uh, just because of the belief that I held. The beliefs that you hold are gonna help you navigate to achieve whatever goal you're trying to reach, okay? You have to navigate properly. If you don't know where you're going, that's one thing. If you don't know where you're going, you're never gonna get there. My piano teacher, you my piano teacher used to always say that to me. If you don't know where you're going, if you don't know where you're going, you're never ever gonna get there. But you have to have the belief that you can do it, that you can achieve whatever you're trying to achieve, all right? All right guys, subscribe, and we're gonna get four, no, we're way past 400. We're gonna get 585 pounds on the deadlift, and we're gonna do the Iron Man. Bye. Bye.